Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Top 5 Deaths of the Week. Hope you guys are having a great day. I got some pretty awesome clips to show you guys, especially you're going to want to stick around to the end and check out the bonus club. I, I don't know. It's something that I think is probably one of the coolest things I've seen in a while in GTA. But as usual, just getting this stuff out the way. If you do have a funny kill, funny death, anything funny happening to you in GTA and you recorded it, go into the description and the instructions on how to actually send that to me are down there. It's really simple to do and maybe you can be featured in a future episode. Hopping right into number five though, we have the Derpinators and they stay true to their name. They're playing a heist mission and normally we would see this kind of behavior from the police helicopters, but I guess now it's moving into the military ones. Now coming in at number 4, we have Polar Monkey, and it's been a while since I featured a clip that has dealt with light poles. You know, for the longest time, I thought the war and the battles were over, but little did I know, the war was never over. As you can see, the light poles have advanced far more than what we thought they could do, and I'll be honest, boys and girls, this might be the end. There's not much you can do against invisible light poles. Moving into number three, we have Goggle Man, and this is a good old karma clip, but not in a way you would expect it. I don't know what's going on in the city of Los Santos. I mean, the light poles are advancing, and now it seems even the cars are advancing. If anybody has an explanation for any of this stuff, Please let me know in the comment section. Now Oscar Martinez here at number two. You know, there's not much I can say about this clip. He just shows why it's not really that great of an idea to play GTA when you have trouble just walking. And then finally come in at number one, we have Hugo Roos, and this is not a death from him, but he caused a pretty awesome death for the other guys. Pay attention to the minimap on this clip. That was definitely a pretty awesome way to get rid of those guys that were shooting at him in GTA Online. But hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, definitely go ahead and drop this video a like. Subscribe so you don't miss these every Wednesday. Now, like I said, this bonus clip, I don't really know how this guy pulled it off. But honestly, as you can see from the clips already shown, invisible light poles, cars getting revenge on people that have shot their drivers. At this point, I'm just beginning to think anything's possible in GTA and in the city of Los Santos. So, <laughs> hope you guys enjoy the bonus clip. But thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next one. And as always, it's your boy Saints fan. I'm out. Peace.